Picasso was an exceptional artist. He revolutionized the plastic arts of the 20th century. He created Cubism and was a master of Surrealism and Expressionism. His work is immense in number, variety and quality. He is also the artist with more paintings in the ranking of most expensive that have been sold so far. Cubism is a mental art which is detached from nature. Art has a value in itself as a means of expressing ideas. Reality is simplified with cubes, cylinders and spheres. Natural colors disappear, giving way to black and white. His fame came when he was young, but it did not change his personality, simple, hard-working and generous. He felt a special attraction for humble people, bulls, and beautiful women. He was an inveterate innovator, moving from one creative phase to another, without closing the door completely to any of the previous ones, and even going so far as to improve styles. But there is one constant, one feature present in everything he did, the search for freedom. Picasso was an exceptional artist. He revolutionized the plastic arts of the 20th century. He created Cubism and was a master of Surrealism and Expressionism. His work is immense in number, variety and quality. He is also the artist with more paintings in the ranking of most expensive that have been sold so far. Cubism is a mental art which is detached from nature. Art has a value in itself as a means of expressing ideas. Reality is simplified with cubes, cylinders and spheres. Natural colors disappear, giving way to black and white. His fame came when he was young, but it did not change his personality, simple, hard-working and generous. He felt a special attraction for humble people, bulls, and beautiful women. He was an inveterate innovator, moving from one creative phase to another, without closing the door completely to any of the previous ones, and even going so far as to improve styles. But there is one constant, one feature present in everything he did, the search for freedom.